Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, my name is Laura and if you've never been here before, I share only natural and organic products, no BS ingredients, um, plastic free, I'm going towards plastic free so and zero waste, but basically only natural and organic ingredients products, nothing else, no dyes, no synthetic ingredients, uh, no coloring, nothing nasty in it. And today I'm going to share my powder blushes. Uh, if you wanna, if you're interested in cream blushes, I'm gonna link my video somewhere up here if you're interested to watch that. But today we are digging only into my powder blushes, and these are all made with awesome ingredients. And the first brand I'm gonna dig in, I have here two blushes from 100% Pure. And actually I got this this year. They had like a huge sale and. I wanted to try more of their blushes and uh, I tried them in the palettes. I have, I think two of their palettes and I really like the blush in the rose gold palette. There was like, I wish they had that one for sale individually because that was the best that I tried from them and it performed amazing. The color is amazing. It has slight sparkle in it, but yeah, that's an amazing uh, blush. Uh, but yeah, today I have uh, here two blushes to share with and I really like the container actually. Uh, these are, um, I think, aluminum containers. I really like this container. They are travel friendly. I think I heard somebody said that these are, you know, if you drop them, they crack and they, they break apart. But it didn't happen with me. I guess I didn't drop it yet or toss it or something. <laughs> um, but yeah, these uh, actually I really like the packaging and I'm thinking to totally reuse this and put something else, press something else in it. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> so we have here uh, two of their blushes. Their blushes are 9 grams and they retail for a whooping $38 each. So they are not cheap so, and I think I got this about half price and yeah that's why i guess i got these and yeah i have here two shades one is darker and one is lighter uh one it's matte and one it looks a little bit more sparkly in the pan like a little bit more satin but we're gonna swatch and we're gonna see them side by side uh we have here healthy and this one is healthy and it's looking so much darker on their website and we have mimosa which looks <laughs> um yeah they don't look alike so much on their website because i ordered online but in the pan like side to side and <laughs> on my cheeks they look so much alike and i was quite turned off by that i guess so let's have the darker shade first this is healthy and 100% uh, pure blushes are actually dyed with fruit pigments so they don't use carmine in their products uh, if you were wondering and especially if you are vegan and if, and if you're interested in uh, vegan products so this is actually healthy which uh, I w I'm wearing it on my cheeks today actually and it has like a beautiful pigment it's very intense and it is looking more on the brown side i guess on their website in their swatch i really thought that this is gonna be more i don't know more brownish than it is it looks more definitely more pinkish uh in person but it's a matte and actually they are based in uh, rice starch so they are very lightweight they feel so beautiful on the cheeks they blend beautiful i really like that and then let's swatch mimosa which looks pretty close to the pan that I have here let's take a swatch of mimosa and looks so much more pinkish and bright when you pick it up from the pan and it has like a not really a shimmer but it's a satin I guess it's it has like a satin kind of finish but when swatched it has like a slight glow but it looks so much alike like the other one maybe it's a little bit i don't know a little bit more brighter but when i, I was looking like one of these days like i put it side by side and i was, I was like really <laughs> 
and I got two of them. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I guess that's what happens when you go, don't go in store and you swatch everything and then you decide to get just one item. So this is Mimosa, the one in the middle. Um, I should say like this. That's the Mimosa on top. And on the bottom is uh, Healthy. <laughs> and they look alike pretty much and yeah um i expected something um a bigger difference i guess in between but yeah these are on the pink side if you're wondering they are both pinks i thought healthy is gonna be more towards a brownish natural color more like towards a bronzer that's how it looks like on the website i guess in their little dot kind of swatch um but yeah these are the fruit pigmented blushes from 100% Pure, and I really like them. It's nothing wrong with them. Uh, I really like them. They, like you see, they do a really, they um, apply very beautifully. They do everything that a blush is supposed to do. So like I said, these are fruit pigmented and they have pomegranate, cherry, goji berry, cranberry, and raspberry fruits in them. And that's what's giving them the color. They are vegan. Uh, they have beautiful ingredients uh, and oils. They have a bunch of oils in them and they are very moisturizing. They don't dry up the skin and I just love them. Now the next brand is Ecobella and I am an Ecobella ambassador and I'm gonna link down my code if you want to save some save some bucks and we have here uh, three blushes and I'm gonna show you they uh, usually come um, packed in this individual small cardboard box so you don't really need another um, they have this beautiful travel cardboard box too to put them in it, in it. but you actually what I'm doing I'm actually keeping these cardboard boxes and I am traveling with it and I'm using it exactly and keeping it like it is like this and I really really like that actually uh, so these are 3.5 grams so they are 100% uh, pure they were 9 grams for $38 these are 3.5 and they are retail for $15.95 so these are a little bit pricier I guess if you're thinking about how many grams it has but in the end I think I'll opt for a smaller size blush because I want to go through faster I guess then you know if I'm not reaching for the same blush on and on and on I'm not that kind of person so if you want to own more color more blushes I will go for the smaller size so we have here peach rose burgundy rose and then in this beautiful cardboard box it has a mirror so these are very very beautiful travel friendly uh, eco friendly they are cardboard and they have a giant mirror in here which i love and let's do some swatches now these do have karma in them keep that in mind they also have a bunch of organic ingredients in them uh, and they are fully natural so some of the ingredients they have uh, first ingredient mica, kaolin, cornstarch so the 100% was rice starch, this is cornstarch sweet almond oil, green tea extract, aloe vera, flower wax, iron oxides bunch of organic ingredients and let's swatch some blush we have this is the peach rose we're gonna, slide, we're gonna do it from light to dark we have the peach rose here and these are so pigmented like I feel like these are even more pigmented the 100% pure slightly powdery so you have to pick a slight amount of this because these are so intense so this is the peach rose and this is more like a neutral nude color and then we have burgundy rose and this is more like a deeper rose more of a rose color as you can see more like a darker pink and the last one is wild rose and this is like really really deep 
and probably this is gonna suit a lot of the deeper skin tones and this is very very deep like this is amazing it looks more deeper in person it has slight shimmer this one as you can see it has like that kind of like a silver shimmer in it silver sparkle it's probably from the mica the other two are quite flat but this one has that shimmer and i think this one goes uh it will go well as an eyeshadow too uh but yeah these are so pigmented and um i love them all now i have two blushes from sapo organics and this also come in a pan like this and they are 3.5 grams each also this they are the same as ecobella again they have a bunch of organic ingredients in them and first ingredient mica and then they have calendula uh, chamomile cornstarch so this is also a cornstarch base just like ecobella um jojoba oil uh, vitamin e argan oil essential oils ah, so these are vegan they have the same uh, grams as the ecobella but this retail for 25 dollars so almost double the price and let's get swatching i have here natalie and this is emma's and uh, the shades they are looking so much different on the website i was just looking on the website they're looking way more intense and we have natalie which is a peach color and it's a beautiful peach actually i really really like this okay so this is natalie it's a very very beautiful peach color pigmentation is just right i really like that and then we have emma which is a pink and it's a very pale pink way more pale than um what it shows on the website it has like a beautiful sheen to it um it's really really beautiful so this is emma it has like a beautiful pinkish hue glow it's a little bit purplish on my hand swatch it doesn't show so much purplish uh, but it's looking almost it has like an iridescence to it it's very very beautiful so there was the sapo and the last blush that i have here is the zao organics and actually i keep it like this this is how it arrives it had like a because it's a refill uh, usually they are having a bamboo case that you can put it in but this is how it's arrived and this is how i kept it actually and yeah i hate the plastic part because it's such a sustainable company <laughs> but i really like it has such a pleasant scent like from all of these blushes um even though i think uh, we have um uh, this one has which one essential oils in the sap organics i don't smell it but this one the zao oh my god it smells so good i don't know what they're putting it so the ingredients first ingredients mica second cornstarch so it's another cornstarch based product uh, and it has it says natural vanilla extract so i definitely smell that and it smells so good oh my gosh oh this smells so good <laughs> and it has uh, shea butter it has glycerin it has uh, cacao seed extract it has many hydrating ingredients in it and the pan is nine grams so it's as big as the 100 percent pure but the price is 18 dollars so this is like the most affordable one the shade is 325 is gold called golden coral and this is such a beautiful shade it's um it has a sheen to it it has like a it's a satin blush and it has like a really really beautiful color let's watch it and even the design it's so beautiful it has like such a beautiful um, sheen to it and i think i was i i might say that this is one of my favorites now 
doesn't look so much it doesn't look like much in my swatch in the camera but uh, in person it looks more intense and it's so 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 beautiful this is so natural and it's very beautiful actually it's more beautiful in person than I can uh, show you in the swatch right now but even the pan it has like this beautiful design and I uh, Every time when I get the Zao product, I'm trying to work around it so that I don't break apart the design, but they are so beautiful. And yeah, this is one of my favorites, actually. So that was my haul of my uh, powders, uh, powder blushes. And you can see I finally achieved, um, I can say that I finally achieved to have a small collection of blushes that... Uh, actually are not having plastic containers except this one <laughs> the Zao. Uh, but yeah this is I believe recyclable but that doesn't make it okay <laughs> but yeah let's do better Zao for packaging because I really love uh, su your sustainable company and the products uh, another product from Zao is m their highlighter their organic highlighter and that's uh, seriously is their my number one highlighter uh, but yeah this was my blushes uh, powder blushes series uh, please watch my cream blushes uh, video also if you like my video please give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more please subscribe thanks for watching and i'll see you next time